So we're venturing into my craft room and yeah, that's Thor and that's Bella. And I guess neither one is gonna move. Um, I have been asked a lot how I store my um, 12 by 12 paper pads. Um, I went through a lot of different trial and error storage systems. Um, I didn't like drawers because I couldn't see them. I had to dig through. I didn't like boxes for the same reason. I actually tried these um, holders like this. Well, actually, they're like these here. So they're like magazine holders, but they're plastic. All they did was tip over from the weight of the paper pads. So right there is the best thing that I found uh, for my paper pads for the 12 by 12s. I ordered this off of Amazon and I liked it so much after trying one, I bought this one's a spare so I can put more paper in it. Imagine that. Um, so I've got one there, one there, one there, one there, and one up here. And it keeps everything upright and I've got a, a very loosely done organization system. Um, I'm not OCD with stuff as far as this kind of thing goes. But pretty much like this shelf holds, this has all my old sheet music, the, the antique sheet music. And these on this shelf are all duplicates. So they're paper pads that I like so much, I bought two. Um, the next shelf I've kind of got solids and like watercolors together. And then this section here, this is all like, um, oh, like more Halloween or grimoire or a little bit darker as far as palettes go. Um, that's there. Uh, the next shelf I've got like florals. And then here I've got all of my um, actual paper, not cardstock, my paper is here. And then up here, I've just got things kind of grouped together that I tend to go to a lot because they're um, more neutral, so I can use them in most any. And then here I have like all my Stamperia specialty paper and Graphic 45. So that's there. And then one of my other holders that I thought would work well for 12 by 12s didn't because it still tipped over and it didn't hold that much. I actually got this at Tuesday morning. Um, this, I've just put in like my wax paper scraps, some of my um, specialty papers back in here, the handmade stuff, vellum, doilies, and some of my open stock papers. So, as far as the entire unit that everything is sitting on, that is uh, also from Amazon, and it is a heavy duty shelving unit. Um, and I believe each shelf will hold um, up to 250 pounds or 300 pounds, but it holds a lot. So I figure it's a perfect thing for all the paper because we all know how much paper weighs. So anyway, that was a birthday gift from my friend Dawn at the Book Vandal Shop, <laughs> which made me laugh, but it was perfect. So it's right there with my paper pads. Anyway, um, hopefully that answers the questions on how I store all of my paper. And I'll put the links below to Amazon for both the um, organizers for the paper itself as well as a shelving unit. But other than that, that's it for now. And I will talk to everybody later. Say bye. <laughs>